What is going on everybody? Your Royal Fatness here, Big Red. Today we are in East Rockaway, New York. We're going right over there to Warden's Deli right now to check out what their bacon, egg, and cheese has got. As always, please make sure you subscribe to the channel so that way you don't miss any review I put out there. And also to help me out a lot, get the word out about Trust Me I'm Fat. That way I can keep doing this for you guys because this is what you need. Now, we're gonna go in and we're gonna eat. Just picked up our bacon, egg, and cheese from Warden's Deli here. First off, wrapping nice big wax paper. All right, let's see if they did double wax paper because that's usually a good sign as well. Also, for the record, I went in here about 12.45, one o'clock, asked the guy for a bacon, egg, and cheese. He gave me that, so I thought they weren't doing eggs anymore, but these guys hooked it up. They made me a bacon, egg, and cheese because they probably heard of me, but you know, that's, no, I'm just kidding. They definitely haven't heard of me, but they hooked it up, they made me one, so now let's get into what we got here. Ah, good little double wax paper. That's what I like to see here. Ooh, look at this bun. Ooh, let's crack her open. Oh, oh, I see a little cheese pull. Little cheese pull, that's good, that's always good. Okay, so far, not a bad looking bacon, egg, and cheese here. We got a nice sesame roll, a little different, don't see that all the time. Sorry, it's windy out here. This place is right on the water, so just know that if you come in here. Nice sesame roll, let's look at the innards here. Fried eggs, it looks like we got two eggs, cheese, and then bacon underneath it. I wanna check the crispiness of the bacon. Bacon doesn't look the crispiest, it looks a little flimsy. Bacon on its own though, decent taste here. All right, let's stop wasting time and get into this. Warden's Deli, East Rockaway, New York. Okay. Can't really distinguish any taste of a bacon. Cheese, good American cheese, nothing to write home about. Looks like some of the bacon is a little crispy, the rest is just kind of like it's been sitting on the grill, but it's not bad by any means. My biggest gripe here, I think is the size of the sandwich. Eggs are fried. Looks like we got, I think we definitely got two eggs on here. So I think two eggs fried. Fried a little hard, not very buttery like I like them usually if they're fried. Like I said, an egg of choice is scrambled always. I'm doing this how they give it to me, that's it. So now I have to say, I think the bun is a little different here than I'm used to and that people would be used to. Ratio isn't, isn't terrible, okay? Not the best, but not terrible. We got, cheese in between the bacon so we got the bacon on the bottom here cheese in between it and then the two eggs on top it's listen it's a decent egg sandwich for what looks like you know just your run-of-the-mill deli here I'm not mad about it I'm not gonna lie all right, let's get down to it. Let's grade this thing. Start off with the roll. The roll was a good roll. I think it was a weird choice of a roll to have on a bacon, egg, and cheese. The sesame, the sesame seed one. I'm gonna give the roll, I'm gonna give the roll <sighs> 2.8 out of five, because I think the sandwich as a whole would have been better if the roll was different. That's just my personal opinion. Uh, next up is the cheese. Not too much cheese, it did do a cheese pull, so we get a point for that, for sure. But it looked like just one piece of cheese thrown on there. That was really it. So the cheese, we're gonna give it three and a half out of five. Bacon, the bacon was, some of it was crispy, some of it was not. Now, you know, if you eat bacon, egg, and cheeses, or you eat bacon in general, okay, you want it to be crispy enough where you have a crunch, not too crispy, where it breaks your freaking teeth, but you also don't want it soggy and flimsy enough to where it just falls and you're not dealing with it anymore. So the bacon here, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go four out of five, because the bacon wasn't, wasn't bad. And now last was the egg. 
Now we had the two fried eggs on here and the egg, I'm gonna give a four out of five because it was, it was done good. It was a little harder than I liked, but at the same time, I ate the egg separately as well, and it still tasted pretty good. Now the moment you've all been waiting for, my overall grading of Warden's Deli in East Rockaway, New York, which, by the way, all the information will be linked down below, so make sure you go and check them out. Overall, bacon, egg, and cheese, I'm going to give this a... I'm going to give it a 6.2. Alright, it's not the best I've ever had, definitely not the worst I've ever had, and I think maybe if I caught them during actual breakfast hours, not in the afternoon like I did, maybe it would be better. That being said, 6.2, it's not a bad score. It's very, this place is good. I will tell you one thing though, if you tried to go to this deli itself, there is only like three parking spots in front of the deli. But the good thing is where I'm sitting right now is basically just a public lot and there's two or three of them all over the place. Go out, check out Warden's Deli and East Rockaway, New York. And that is all I got for this week's Trust Me I'm Fat. So thank you all for tuning in. Please make sure you like the video, subscribe to the channel, and turn on the post notifications so you don't miss anything that's going on around here. And uh, I will see you next week.